Yes, I was starring in that along with the Puerto Rican who was a backup dancer in Michael Jackson's Beat It. Really? Yeah, yeah. A lot of people were not expecting that it was trailblazing to have a uh, Puerto Rican backup dancer be my co-star. A lot of people were expecting a Puerto Rican store clerk or uh, worker or someone from a bodega, but we said we are going to keep it classy. This man was picked by Michael Jackson for a reason to dance in the back in row 37 where no one can see, and that means something. Now, have you ever danced in a in a video? Uh, uh, is this legal? Legal videos? Yeah. Okay. Um, yeah. Yes. Yeah, as a matter of fact, it's all been legal <laughs> under the advice of um, uh, of, the, of my parole officer. It is all been one hundred percent legal. In all my dancing. Right. We're gonna get we're gonna get right back to you, but you brought a beat it, so that made me think of a uh, Jr. Uh, <laughs> big on the masturbating. Uh, Someone asked me. Do you have um? I don't know if you're a roommate or do you have any pets? I, I think I have a cat. Oh, really? What's your what's your cat's name? And tell us a little bit about your cat. His name's Ralphie. It's Ralphie. Yeah. Once again, our intel is wrong. No, Who up, Steve? There's a weird assumption we had in the backstage of this. Okay, yeah. Uh, no, he's Ralphie. Okay. I I got him when I was like nine. Like 15 now. He's a cat. Okay. <laughs> he, like, my life. he likes laying on me. Yeah, I, I, honestly, preparing bad. for the show has made it a lot better. You see how it is? Yeah. He right. was on Epstein's Island, though, if that helps. He wasn't. Was it? Oh, I got it. Okay. I, wow. Yeah. Is, yeah. There, is there a market for underage? No, he, he, he participated <laughs> in like the bar, like the. Slow cooking of children at the altar, or whatever they were doing. Saying, Moving on, we'll get we'll get back to you. I'm gonna we'll go one thing, one through, and then one thing back. I can't speak. Give me some it's like a like a typewriter. One, one. Helen Wildy. Okay. Uh, two part question. One is, were you born here in North Carolina? And if not, tell us a little bit about what brought you here and where you were born. I like in North Carolina. <laughs> I was born in Belfast, Northern Ireland. Grew up in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Re most recently moved here from Seattle, Washington, and I moved here uh, because of my partner's job, my lesbian partner. <laughs> Not my business, my roommate. My roommate, my roommate, my roommate yeah. Um, yeah, no, but North Carolina, what a beautiful, beautiful state. Interesting shape. It is an interesting shape. And boy, shape you guys love to sell things in the shape of yeah, North Carolina. Yeah, teacher wise, it works <laughs> a lot. Oh, yeah. TJ, like... everywhere you go, I'm like, what is, what, why does this look kind of familiar to me? Almost the shape of this coffee table. Uh, well, <laughs> what, other, what other things is it almost the shape of? Oh, great question. Um, it's like if you squished down a beanie, <laughs> it kind of looked like that. If you like ripped a piece of paper, it would often look like North Carolina. What I love about Helen, because I follow her on Instagram, oh, thank you. and I'm going to plug your Instagram wow. to the millions of people watching this live with a stream. I don't think it's even working, but oh, this is going to be huge. <laughs> I'm talking about the, the, the video <laughs> afterwards. My phone might explode from this. Instagram. Helen will throw a bunch of jokes out there and ask people with the idea of them helping, and then she's going to get a, a winner. Well, a lot of us will only you know throw three and then go with the best, but Helen, <clears throat> she'll. You give a good 20. What was the one I for did. the first joke at, at Good Nights of the Year? What was that thing? You had some bad puns. 
But she had some good ones in there too, and all she needed was one. I like to counteract every good pun with a couple bad ones, just to keep the audience sad. <laughs> she was... Alright, we're, yeah. we're going to, uh, I need to find a little bit more about these other two contestants. I feel like everyone knows you very well. Also, let it be known that um, we try to have one lesbian guest on every episode, so, you know, just And saying. today, it's not who you think. Question for the, all the people watching live is to put uh, your second guess, you know, after Alan, who would have been between, between these two gentlemen. Pretty hey. sure. Who's, who's the most, lesbian? Who's the most likely to be, the second most likely to be a lesbian on the couch? I eat pussy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and you're. Hell yeah. I think you just won. So I don't want to go. But, uh, the poll, oh the poll over Instagram is like J R one hundred two percent. Coors Light. I asked him to ask me some questions where I could he could then go with it and do some comedic things. And so the first one was about his cat, and that you know obviously that killed it. So now he, you mentioned Coors Light. So let me ask you, what is what is your deal with Coors Light? Uh, it's the staple of my childhood and my early adulthood. <laughs> childhood. <laughs> you know, it's just, I came from the bottom with this, and I nice. plan to drink and drive with it. That's like kind of. Uh, well, I'm not technically drinking chorus. That's the. Whole I know, thing. I know, I know. So that's, that's why that's why you're allowed to say because it's, it's a joke because it's not drinking chorus. Like right. if it was chorus line, that's oh, mission saving battle. Oh, so you me like a cup of ice. Yeah, thanks. Uh, all right, so Wafik, I did some deep digging and found out that you were a fan of Bill Cosby back in the day when he was America's dad. Also, ironic the reason I saw a video the other day. It's, it had Mike, somehow Mike Tyson has has become like everyone loves Mike Tyson. At a time he was like, and Bill Cosby, everyone used to love. And now, so again, I found information that Bill Cosby is out of jail. Which also was interesting because when he was going to jail in the, in the trial and when they were when they were doing the sentence, all of a sudden you couldn't see. When he was leaving the jail, he's like, "No, I, I don't need any help. I can, I can see all of a sudden." Yeah. So uh, tell us a little bit about Bill Cosby, and, and if you happen to have an impression, go ahead. Well, uh, first of all, I want to explain what you saw was a common technique used in the uh, colored folks community <laughs> of um, when when you are, 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 are in danger of going to jail, you lose a sense. <laughs> If you remember, uh, <laughs> if you remember, I'm serious. If you remember Sammy Sosa, he oh, forgot how to speak oh, yeah. when, when he was under oath in Congress. He forgot how to speak English. This is what we do. This is survival instinct. This is survival. When the slave catchers would catch you, you forget how to speak English, and it's immediately, oh, I didn't know the road to freedom was that way. I was, in, and if you could imagine, and Bill is no different. He knows. He's been around. For quite some time. When, when, when you walk into the jail, you know, you, can't you just imagine him walking into the courthouse and he's confused, he's looking around, does everybody know which way is is the colored side of the courthouse? I didn't know we could come in through the front. All of a sudden I'm confused. I don't know which way is, is the colored side. And because he's an older comic, you know, he he hasn't been to jail recently. He should have talked to Cat. Williams. But he has been to jail recently. He's very much been to jail recently. Well, he's well, free now. Yeah. He's free yeah. now. Oh, you talk, you talking about recently, like the last two yeah, months. Yeah, yeah, like not as much as other comics. <laughs> yeah, right. you know. Okay. <laughs> not as much as other comics. You said no, I'm saying, com yeah, I'm saying, had he talked to Cat yeah, Williams, had okay. he talked to Cat Williams, uh, Cat could have told him how to operate in uh, when you are going to jail now, and he would have been better off. When it comes down to it, it's all about the long game. We just learned, wow. We just learned from our man, Alex. I'm not trying to, he just got in a relationship. He said, 23 years, way to upstage my show, JR. Last time you're on the show. I was just trying to keep the mountains blue. 20, <laughs> can you cover up that sign too? I'm just worried about the ice on the 23 floor. years in the making, he's been he's been trying to get his girlfriend or, or since he known her any better. And you saying, what was I saying? Bill Cosby? Yeah. You should have planned ahead. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You got to plan ahead for your free jail stay. Mm -hmm. You think? You think? Okay. Before we get to the first game, because I've seen you do this bit, so I can't nudge you anymore. Do you think that the people uh, that are in the jail, there's any sadness about him leaving? Um, I, absolutely, absolutely. Because I'm, I come from a single parent household, and I know what it's like to have a father figure come swooping in 
and then all of a sudden he's taken away. So I would imagine they are very much upset. The whole, the whole, you know how many uh, violent attacks were averted in prison because oh, Bill was there to stop someone. Do you know how many, how many, how many prison riots Bill was there, was there to stop? Was he uh, called America's prison dad during that time? He was. He was actually at that time. Matter of fact, that's good. He was America's prison dad, and I'm pretty sure. He took the time to recreate the whole Cosby show behind bars, <laughs> and, and he probably named everybody. Cause you know, I'm saying, look, in prison, everybody has a job to do. There's the guy who can get you anything that you want in in prison, and that's like, uh, and um, Bill probably called him Walmart Theo because <laughs> <laughs> he can get anything. And there's Walmart Theo, uh, there's neo Nazi Theo. He just kept, had a bunch of different Theos. Oh, yeah. You know, it's probably a bit of a uh, a, a controversy and beef behind bars. As soon as he gets mad at Walmart Theo, he listen, some of some Walmart Theo. You got thirty checkout places in the prison, but there's never more than one open at any given time. You better shape up, cause the new boy looks like he'd be a great target, Theo. <laughs> The Rice is Right. This game is very similar to a game that I didn't even know about called The Price is Right. I don't know. Anyways, <laughs> you're going to say, I bought this rice this week, so it's inflation, you know, advanced, right. whatever, whatever. I'm not going to tell you what store. I mean, if you see the name of the store, that's fine. You know, I already know it's not Target. You have to guess what it is. If you go over, you automatically don't win. That's because, you know, Price is Right did it too. You know, just copy it. So right. Just, you want to go last because there's a reason for that. And is that Boss Mighty Rice? Yeah, you got, you know what? While I'm finding that die, okay. where's that bucket that I had of, uh, of a thing? You know those things up there that we were throwing around? I like how you got this ethnic rice, this Boss Mighty Rice, instead of just regular white rice. Mm -hmm. yeah, you got, I, everyone, everyone take a look at that rice. This is the part of the game where I look for something. Dice. Yeah, but where's that big, and where's that, where's that, the, the can anyways, because I need okay. that. Maybe I put it in there. Keep on talk, talk about the rice. Okay, it's from... They want, they want to know. It's, it's white rice. rice. What, what else can I say? <laughs> I got to talk all day about it's white rice. rice. Is it Asian No, it's rice? from Lidl, which is like all these little brother, I think. Yeah, it's Basmati. And like all day is like basically like a Western version. It's right. off the stairs. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. But it's white Basmati rice. We talk all day about white rice. We never talk about black history rice. <laughs> 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 Listen, there's a whole. If you go to elementary school. I know you, you know, do Cosby. The there's a whole. <laughs> they teach you Europe and white rice stuff all year, and you got like two weeks to go over Africa and brown rice. And we here we are. You say keep talking about white rice. Haven't we talked enough about white rice? You're right. You're right. My brother. There. And you, you want to hear something interesting? What's that? Uh, there was a cheaper bag of rice that was. Brown rice at the store. I got, <laughs> and the problem is, I got too much rice in my house from this game, and I don't like to eat brown rice. You know. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> oh, you, so oh. you're gentrifying wow. the rice. Wow. You gotta move the brown rice. So I figured, out of the I'll pay extra Ooh. because I'm gonna because I want to make some like, chicken fried rice or something this week. Anyway, it's time for the first. That's you want to go last? So roll the die. Whoever gets the. Uh, the 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 lowest number goes first, the second lowest number goes second, and the, the highest number goes last. So I just, 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 just throw it anywhere to build, and then build to say the number. Well, last episode Bill was catching everything, but this episode he drank. Okay. That's a five. Five, okay. That's a one. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, you can catch it with your. I forgot. Oh, that's he's a pro. That's a oh, six. six. That's a All right. So we said what we said. Jr. JR goes last. JR goes last? Yeah. yeah. So our Helen, Wafik, JR. Uh, yeah. Alright. You want to look at it again or you want to get ready for your price? I'm about ready for my price. I mean, this is a heavy bag of You can ask some questions, I just want to write. Yeah, no, no. I have seen you under pressure. <laughs> <laughs> I, I totally break. <laughs> the man doesn't sweat. He has no sweat. 
blood glands. Okay, wait. 32 <laughs> ounces. That's heavy. Okay. I don't it's like, know. It's like two pounds, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Watch <laughs> out. Watch out. I'll pretend they're helping you, they're not helping you. like two pounds. Um, um, I'm going to say this bag was 823. Ooh, wow. Okay. Before you go on, I already messed up. I forgot to say the prize you guys are going to win. Now. The prize is right. <laughs> That's good. Uh, Is the prize racism? I try. <laughs> I try to have prizes that are not just something that, that you can't use, and also specific to a time. So, what's today's date? February sixth. Six. Yeah. With Christmas just ten and a half months away, you can win Christmas lights with the frosty thing. For outdoor use, Yay. and if you want, just to you know test because there's rumors that I give out like half half working drills. We'll test it, and it, it works. I tested it last night. You, you still want to stick with your what was it? Eight sixty five. Okay, you say? I said eight twenty three, but I guess knowing what I know now, what's at stake? Woo! Knowing what's at stake, is it is it the same as a certain show where if I go over? Well, that's literally the certain that's show was my show. What the I said only at the time. Role. That's the only rule. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna change mine to five. 521. Oh, 21 is my number, so okay. All right. Oh. Uh, Happy number. Happy <laughs> number. All right, well, Pete, you ready? Yeah. So this is legal brand rights, right? Okay. He's trying, to, he's trying to quiz me. See, I didn't break. I thought about it for a second, saying. All right, okay, okay. Fancy packaging. It is white Basmati rice. I would expect it to want to be fancy. <laughs> to want to be fancy. <laughs> to want to be fancy. I know, man. You ever notice? I bet this was taken from an aisle that uh, it was a it was a dimly lit aisle with a lot of brown rice, and then slowly but surely, more and more white rice started moving into the aisle. <laughs> and suddenly, and and, and now I bet the brown rice couldn't afford to be in the aisle. You know what I'm talking about? They got pushed to the lower, you know, shelf while the white rice was on the top shelf, and now that's called whiteification. Or riceification. Rice. <laughs> uh, so I'm going to say. The place, anyway. I'm going to say. She said five twenty three. I'm going to say this is five dollars seventy five cents. Oh, nice. Yeah. She was. He was kind to you because you really want. Well, I won't say because I don't want. I'll tell you afterwards. Leslie screwed me. I know. Yeah. She did the one thing. All right, Jr. We, we, we need a quick guess for this one. I don't need to rush you. Should we clip that? It's been a, it's been a, it's been a lot of time spent on rice, more than I've ever spent on rice. Yeah. Uh, well. Um, but no, you can you can you can debate it though. You also can talk about gentrification or riceification too. Uh, well, the ice is starting to melt. So. <laughs> so many holes in this box. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna say a dollar. One dollar. Oh. There's always there's, there's one. Jerk who bids a dollar on the prices. Right. Right. So, why, why he did you a solid is he could have done five twenty two, yeah. which would have been you know. No, that would have been over. We well, yeah, and the and the, the answer to this thing is who wins? I love doing this part. Right? That was That's cool. Cool. Jr. The price was two eighty five. You Well, you're lucky. You know, honestly, Trey last week bit, bit a thousand. <laughs> he thought it was grains. All right, guess what? Everyone always wants the rice, but you don't get the rice. You do get the Christmas lights. Yeah. You want me to take it? No, no. <laughs> I, love, I like that. You want? It's like you're trying to get him to get it off. You, you sure you don't want him to take it? No, I, I want the Christmas lights. Congrats. Yeah. All right. Well deserved. Well paid, hey. sir. We got a new show, new contest for you. Mm -hmm. Bill has created this one. And Bill is going to join us and tell us the name. And I'm going to do the first one. And then we're, we're going to roll with that. We're just going to do it. We're just going to do it. I'm going to give him cards and pens. We're going to do it. We're doing it live. So you read the uh, highlighted. Yeah. So this is So first, first, come here and look at the camera, the, the good camera. That camera? Oh, yeah. And just say what the name of the show is. This is Inside the Bad Actors Studio. And we're going to read scenes from a movie poorly. Okay. And you try to guess the movie. Right. I will say when you drink beer out of a mug, you lose a lot. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Experience is significantly worse. That's actually a, another game we're doing. Drink well, beer out of a mug. I mean, <laughs> well, I mean, like a why moms do this at PTA meetings. Yeah, so yeah. Like, I don't know. All right. And students from. You guys need something to write with, right? Mm-hmm. 
things, the things that everyone needs, you know? All right. Well, this is, this is, oh, the prize, once again. I'm bearing the lead. Oh, oh, and then this is a top of the line one. This is a multi-purpose container. It could be used for soap, sanitizer. It was bought at Ikea. And listen. The excitement. I, was like, I thought it was just going to be shit for us. I didn't know. It's bought from Ikea, which you can be like, well, it's cheap. But it, you uh -huh. know how much delivery is? So if you actually bought this online. Swedish yeah, technology. I use this for sanitizer. In my car, it fits the thing. I'm just saying, this one has never been used. even has a sticker on it. The winner will win that. All right, here we go with the first one. After Studio. Do I have my paper? Yeah, they're on the... Right down, I guess. No, read from the other side. They were in the other side. Right. It really looks like I we'll do three and three 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 Remember, we're not going to read with their accents, but we'll see if you guys know it. Okay. And, and, and you don't shout it out, you just write it in the card. And it, okay. like, and then immediately afterwards, we're going to ask. So we just guess the movie. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Uh, we should tell you. JR's having so much fun. I know. Yeah. <laughs> this is actually, this is actually I've never, I've never, I've never heard you so excited. Yeah. <laughs> what do you mean I'm funny? It's funny, you know. It's a good story. It's funny. You're a funny guy. Ha ha. What do you just mean? Number, you yeah. mean the way I talk? What? It's just, you know, you're just funny. It's funny the way you tell the story and everything. You mean, let me understand this, cuz... You know, maybe it's me. I'm a little fucked up, maybe. But I'm funny how? I mean, funny like I'm a clown? I amuse you? Did you see that icon? Oh. Obviously you didn't, because JR is just doing his ADD thing. Uh, I make you laugh? I'm here to fucking amuse you? I'm getting with the cusses. What do you mean, funny? Funny how? How am I funny? All right, write down your guesses. So do we just guess the movie? Or... Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got, and you got five seconds to write down your guesses. Okay. Five, I got it wrong. four, three, Two, one. Do you have it written down? Yeah. All right. No more writing. All right. Who wants to guess first? Go ahead. Uh, Goodfellas. Correct. Yes. Well, I'm going to put Dodgeball. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. a good guess. I couldn't remember the name of the movie, so I wrote yeah, like, Joe, Pesci. Joe Pesci, Ray Liotta, uh, Dan Danny DeVito, director Martin Scorsese. That's good for him. That's good for him. And you also watch the We give partial credit. It's not Danny DeVito. It's Robert De Niro. Close enough. It's not Danny DeVito, it's Robert De Niro. Danny DeVito is the one from Taxi. They're basically that's what, that's what the worth. same person. <laughs> All right. Danny uh, DeVito is like 4'10". So, so half a point, so and then uh, and Ooh, JR man. come in with the heat with the Ooh. point. Oh, man, I need this thing in my life. Uh, what do you think I masturbate to all day? <laughs> Just Joe Pesci. I thought you meant like you were going to use this, but never mind. Uh, by the way, I'm sorry. He said bad actors. I'm sorry if my acting was yeah, too good. This was supposed to be bad. I know, my bad. Basically, talking to Joe Pesci. Just me and a little bit, because I'm not sure. All right. Second one. You're going to write it down on the same card. Here we go. Okay. This one's just what are really just what is just <laughs> like, what, yeah. and then, and then you say something after that? Well, I'm just saying the white part. Because I've never seen over. Goodfellas. Is there a white yeah. part? Oh, yeah, right. Here we go. No, and she uses her excuse of being lesbian. I didn't say that. I didn't say that. You want to bring it out? Why? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, this one I think is going to be all right. Then. Okay, great. Everyone in the world knows who you are. My mother oh. has trouble remembering my name. Oh. Okay. Fine. Fine. Good decision. The fame thing <laughs> isn't really real, you know. Don't forget, I'm also just a girl standing in front of a boy, asking, asking him, him to, to love, love her. her. I think we're supposed to kiss now, but... Kiss! Yeah, so Do it! I like, I like how you wrote it. Do it! I love her. I feel like Hermione right now. Use your tongue. <laughs> you're supposed to... You, we know you got it right, but write it down. I did. Okay. Uh, oh, wait, make her go last, then. I yeah, did. Yeah, yeah. In fact, we're not going to... Yeah, we're not going to say who's right until everyone's guess. Oh, now who's gay if we're never having seen... <laughs> <laughs> we're never having seen Goodfellas. Um, if y'all haven't seen this, classic. I stand by my statement. <laughs> Now who's gay is don't make it fun. Damn it. Now who's gay is another contest I'm ready to do later. <laughs> <laughs> I really should prep the losing. Okay. Alright, what's your guess? Okay, uh, clearly that was Sugar Walls number 12. <laughs> um, starring Roxy Reynolds, Obsession, and Pinky. Oh, uh, so close. Guess. All right, so ahead, yeah. I guess the Joy Luck Club. <laughs> <laughs> 
It was obviously Notting Hill. Yes. Starting yeah. Julia Roberts, Hugh Grant, etc. Mm. I feel like there was potential for people to accidentally say um, Jerry Maguire. Isn't there like a line where, where unless it's, I don't there know. was no mistaking that. No, that is. I already lost my. Spirit. I do encourage you all to watch Sugar Walls in the bed. Yes, number twelve. Do you have to now, watch the first start, one? Now can you start? can you start with twelve and work your way back? I would say start with twelve because that's the best. Yeah. 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 It's like Fleabag season two. You don't even need season. Does the lead actress look like a C version of Pam Greer? Uh, the, her insides or the outsides? Uh, a little above. Whoa! Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, Why didn't you write me? Why? It wasn't over for me. I waited for you for seven years, but now it's too late. I wrote you 365 <gasps> letters. Guys, I wrote is... you every day for a year. Yeah, I you know. wrote me? I yes, it wasn't before. over. It still isn't over. I have a guess. I don't know. All right, uh, Lafitte, you're going to go for it first. Okay, uh, I wrote, <clears throat> as a reminder, this is Black History Month. <laughs> <laughs> I have a black movie. I purposely put a black movie in Sasha. <laughs> Why are they asking me all this black stuff? This is February. We should be talking 90s. Growing up in the hood movies. I have. And Sasha just skipped. Let me see what. Let me see the next one is. Uh, a movie all about white people. <laughs> What's your guess? I'm. So, I'm. So, you know. I oh, that was specific. <laughs> <laughs> uh, was he right? Was he right? Was he right? Was he right? Was he guess. What he said. Um, oh. Why are we talking about <laughs> the movies only? <laughs> no, that's not right. Who gives a point though? Because they are. Uh, <laughs> the Notebook. Yes. Yeah, and he does. He doesn't fuck her before he dies. That's a, a, a tactical um, error. Spoilers for the notebook. <laughs> I also wrote the notebook. Yeah. But it does feel like he's worse. I never I seen have. a notebook. I, I just know it's that kind of guy. They already right. told me three times he's never seen it, which is what people say when they watch it. First thing I want to know is you're the first <laughs> contestant to ever get three half points. You don't get this, though. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hands up. There you okay. go. Good. Yeah, wow. So it's a, it's a real, like, fill your own. Does it the come, last does one it was... come loaded? All right. Uh, two years into this pandemic, it has turned me into a horrible person. Uh, my coworker was coughing three times around me, and immediately I started hoping it was a drug addiction cough <laughs> and, and just not a COVID cough, please. Um, I was praying, Lord, just please let it be I don't know, like the 1998 crack residue cough and, and not COVID, anything. Let this man be a member, a part of the heroin epidemic of opioid crisis. Just not, don't be coughing COVID on me, please, when you're around me. And I know that's, that's bad. That's a terrible thing to say. But it gets worse. I'm going to say something else bad. We've been having too much fun. Um, Bill Cosby should not be out of prison. And I know that's not popular with black people, but he should not be out of prison because um, we need to spend more time, seriously, talking about the victims of this heinous crime instead of his, his race. And by victims, I mean uh, the guys in prison he left behind that he was mentoring. Uh, you don't say anything about them. What about them? When you grow up without a father, you will take any father figure that you can get. And these guys... These guys had Bill Cosby, America's favorite dad, in prison with him. You know they had a ball. Bill recreated the entire cast of The Cosby Show, gave everybody fatherly advice. It was wonderful. Let's, let's new Theo. You don't have to force yourself on the band, new Theo. Ten shoulder nice night out on the prison yard. Get down on one knee. Give him some of your cigarettes. He'll be yours for life, new Theo. <laughs> you don't have to force yourself. <laughs> and he was right. The Bill Cosby Prison Mentorship Program was working. Okay? And we stopped that for what? For the first time in years, these guys could call another man daddy. <laughs> without having sex with him. <laughs> and that is what mentorship is all about. <laughs> JR, yeah. time to get shot. I 
again? Yeah. Okay. But this time, we didn't want to shoot the real JR. So I worked hard on this. And also, so you can participate. We got ourselves a, a JR. And uh, you guys are welcome to sit there, but we're going to be shooting this direction. So you, know, you might want to, you might want to move. This is a great picture of me, by the way. Yeah, it's a selfie. Wow, look how smooth I did that with the carabiner you forever. Not forever. I did. I took All right. A pride. And I <laughs> pride. Uh, it's easy for me to run around. Amuse yourself. Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> It was either this or the tower pick. The tower pick? Yeah. <laughs> you want to pass the beach? Yeah, sure. Okay. sure. I'm telling you, I needed another 10 square feet in my apartment or a smaller desk, one or the other. Because this is really not that easy. That's a beautiful desk. One time I'm going to fight it and it's going to be, I said it's going to be It's going to be hilarious for everyone to set me. It's kind of nice, but I feel like it's over. You guys really? <laughs> <laughs> you, guys, nice. you guys really want to sit there? Sure. Yeah, All, right. All right, so, so they, too, too pretty of a face to hit no. in the face. You get no points if you hit him in the right. face. You get no points if you hit the real JR. And here it is. This thing is supposed to stick. It doesn't stick that well. But where it lands, if it lands half of the ball, at least, in the three, you get three points. If it lands anywhere on the thing, you get one point. Ox, you sticking with me? Uh -huh. I, I, I Ox is good. He gets his on the go. I didn't even prep him on this. Three points, one point. He falls down. It doesn't matter, all right? You guys want me to do a practice one just to show you how it's done? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Sure. Gonna use this like this thing. Here. Then I was thinking about using uh, Al Baldwin's prop gun, okay. but the problem with that is, you know, sometimes it doesn't work. As it, doesn't. <laughs> well, it doesn't really kill somebody. So I got a real gun. No, it will shoot through someone and then kill someone. That's how it works. That's the producer of my work. So that'll be oh, one point. Okay. I got extra balls. Yes. It just came through. I see it. Well, you should you you move see the camera. No one likes a braggart. Do you want to move the camera? No, we're not playing move the camera anymore. But uh, the they can just see it in the back. We'll, we'll, they'll, they'll go with the oohs and the ahs. That's fair. That's fair. Okay. As we do it. It's your show. <laughs> You're right. It's, easy to it's move like, no, no, wait. It's like, all right. So if it rolls through three. So you get, you get, um, you know what? Since I'm a generous person, I was going to say you get three shots. But because it's their first time shooting the gun, you get four shots. Don't take more than four shots. You always lose every game, and I hate you forever. The reason I say it's you because because you're known to play with guns. Who likes to go first? <laughs> this will be the closest. Yeah, okay. I mean, nice. I'm holding it wrong, right? Yeah. <laughs> 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 this will be the closest. If you shoot, if you shoot yourself, you also get no points. She has no practice. Oh, yeah. Okay, I just pull it back and then. Yeah. So so. I just push forward. Yeah. This. Yeah. I don't want to say it's something about cocking it. That's the one. Nope. Okay. Oh. All right. So the first Sorry, one. Sorry, guys. You, I got you a beautiful <laughs> yeah. face. Yeah. But it's like hard to be secure. Oh. Okay. Which, that's, that's a point. Look at the point. point. Yeah. We're, we're very liberal with that, that's that's like, like, You can move up. Back, you can move up a little bit if you want. <laughs> I'm just gonna stare it down the. Well, then I want to see you. There we go. All right. That's nothing. You got one more shot. Oh wow. Yeah. Yeah. You're generous. That's right. Yeah. yeah. Push. Come on. Three. Come on. Three. Big money. Big money. Three. Oh, I hit the face. I, know, I feel like people are going to purposely lose just to get in the face. Fair uh, enough. You want to go next? I found, yes. I found <coughs> Best for oh, last. Best for last. All right. Four right. shots. <laughs> Four shots. Just some people at home because they might, you know. You know. Three points, one point, no point. <clears throat> so what was your total? One? One. Sorry. Decent chance. Decent? Hey, I'm already, I'm already leaving here. A huge victory. For everybody watching, please take note. The white man has <laughs> willingly given me the gun. <laughs> I am now using two hands to hold it in a non-threatening manner. Hold on a second. I just got to call the police real quick. Mark, <laughs> <laughs> the same. How close can I be? You can, uh, yeah, you can be there. That's good. Okay. You can, uh, uh, kneel Is this heading your way? No, no, no. You're good. Okay. Ooh. Ooh! That's it's one. Stuck. <laughs> That's how it's supposed to do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, I went in. I didn't uh, push it. I think that was three. another one. That was three. That was a three. Oh, you got you're rocking with a four now. Alright. I got it for this one. It's like 
Dude, you've yeah. never been safer, JR. See, this is American, <laughs> America's sniper. Dude, he, yeah, he's doing it like a sniper. I thought he has, he, you had a telescope to it? He's killed a man. A telescope? Yeah. <laughs> he that's a three oh, also. That's a three yeah. as well, okay. Seven. Jerry, you have to really give it to yourself, kind of like your nightly thing. Oh, yeah. yeah. I double. Oh, yeah. oh, that was Jerry. Oh, that right. was man. So seven. I think you're right. going to win. Okay. How, how many balls are there? That's hard to beat. Yeah. There you go. All right, let's beat it. All right, yeah. All right. I guess I can tell. No, I'm not sitting underneath. All right, that's it. Stand underneath. All right. Well, all right. All right, JR. This is the game. moment you've been waiting for. I know you were like, I want to go to this game show to shoot at myself. Just yeah, like, in the backyard, right behind you. Well, this is the closest I get it to like, actually like, shooting myself. Can I get a picture of it? Like, your, your face is like, is that? This is what it's all about. about. I'm just like, it's the NG. Well, it's, dude, this is like, this is what, this is like the closest uh, I can get no. to like, killing myself without killing myself. So, you know, <laughs> it's, it's, it's a safe suicide. It is. This is like the metaverse version of a suicide. The triple shoot. Hell yeah. Do I wake up in the shower in the afterlife? Is the metaverse? Yeah. It marks out the blue. Can we like that? I missed it. What do you get? Zero. Zero. That's what people say. I missed it. What do you say? Uh, oh, that's zero. Okay. okay. That was in the middle one. Step one. I think Hell is giving a three. No, it was, it was just oh. three, so okay. that was a three. Is that a three? Alright, that's. Yeah. Alright! And then once again, what did what did Sasha do? I knew. That's what I'm saying. I can't put more bullets. <laughs> Thank you. Oh wait, hold up. And we're back. I'm just kidding. Uh, the prize. One second. Who's winning this? I believe I won that one. Yes. Mm -hmm. All right, let's see. Oh, Thank you. Wow, Thank they might have shot better if they known this. Mm. Oh. You are winning a Carolina Panthers. What's it called? Beer Stein mug. Yeah. Okay. That's All right. Wow, that's actually right? Nice. Yes, this is football, <laughs> and I'm a Panthers fan, so this is great. Oh, hell yeah. Right up my alley. Thank you so much. Wait, hold on a second. Yes. Also, let it be known, I think it's a Black Panther. Yes, which reminds me, I want to <laughs> thank all the gangbangers I grew up with <laughs> for, for helping me get here to this moment. Thank you so much. Happy February. Happy February. I'm right. yeah. It's time for Two Truths and a Die. <gasps> okay. Okay. That was good. <laughs> <laughs> Alex comes every week from now on. You're like, we practice that. <laughs> <laughs> Alex, what a bit. Uh, oh, yeah. Uh, you throw the die, mm -hmm. and depending on the number, you want a low number because that's going to be how many lies there are going to be, and there's going to be two truths. So if there's one mm -hmm. lie, you know, six lies, it's going to be a little more difficult. You, you say the two truths, you get it correct. But there's actually a first round to this because not everyone gets to play four. Look at me doing the prize ahead of time. Sticking with the sports theme. Sports. You're from South Carolina originally, right? That's right. And you're from New York State, right? North Carolina. My parents are right next to each other. And you're from Ireland. Can you do your Irish accent? She's Northern Irish. She doesn't really count. So I'm guessing you guys are all big Dallas Mavericks fans. For your keys. Oh, yeah. Yeah, the dirt. The All the Irish players in Ireland. Can you do your Irish accent? Alright, so that's how you're gonna win. So now you know okay. who's gonna go first? First one gets the highest roll. Again, throw it to throw it to Bill. Do do the whole throw it off the white thing. That's the easiest thing if it bounces that way. Yeah. Okay. Woo! Oh, wasn't the easiest. It's a four. It's a four. It's a very honor system game here. So I was. We haven't decided yet. Whoever gets the highest is gonna get to play the game. So yes, that's a decent roll. A six. six! Wow. So we want to get the highest. Yeah, so you yeah. Need to get a six, get a six now, six. or else JR is okay. going to be. You know, they could all just play. Just throw it at Four is pretty high. Before the game, you were like, let's cut, the, cut it down. Now you're like, no. Keep them here. Yeah. <laughs> Lock the door, Bill. You get a six? You get Three. Three. All right, JR, you're going to be playing. And now, you get to roll again. 
Let's not throw it at Bill. In fact, if you hit Bill on the throw, it doesn't count. No, it is. Now, let's see, because we've messed this up every time. Scared. No, it is. Do you want a high number or a low number? Wait, is this the dice I'm rolling? That's going to be the dice you're rolling. So do I want to pick a high for the dice I roll? For like the number I'm just I guessing roll. if you were paying attention. Do you, would you, would you, do you want a one or a six right now? I was drinking. Um, <laughs> what is it? You have fifty percent chance of being right, or use your math skills. Well, so like four, five, and six is. Also, I got women here watching that are interested in going on a date with you, and I've sold that you're actually intelligent. So this is very important. That's a low ball that you, no one can live up. To. <laughs> <laughs> uh, this is the most fun. You I'll want go, a low number? Sure. You're right. All right, you want a low <laughs> number? Here we go. Here we go. Last week, Jake was like, "Yeah, yeah, I want to get a one." Okay. And then Trey was like, gonna get a six, then you got a six. All right, all right, all right. let's go. Don't hit Bill. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so I had a five. Got a five, five. Uh, five off there. All right. <laughs> Cause we're a well-oiled machine right now, we have a prepared list. Uh, so five of these are- Do I read eight? them? Yeah, yeah, I guess right. Good. I'm gonna read these. Let, let's see how much he's been paying attention, because now that we've, so I, I'm gonna read seven things. Okay. And. Two are going to be. <laughs> it's either true or false. What are you going with? Two are going to be true, and the other five are going to be. This one's really easy now. The other five are going to be. False. Yes! Oh. <laughs> Quick learner! This is a weird assumption you brought on about right. me. I feel uncomfortable. <laughs> I might read to you after this question, because I don't know. Are you I once picketed a used car dealership. You don't have to decide yet. Here until a pet bunny. I owned a pet bunny named Mr. Bun Buns. I mean, I sat next to Bill Murray on the L. What the movie? Yeah, that was a subway train in Chicago. Okay, well, I mean, I was confused. Yeah. I have webbed toes. Probably. <laughs> Sasha's mom is from Slovakia. I mean. Patientness is unreal. <laughs> the what is unreal? Well, speaking of moms, if Jared's mom is watching, uh, she is not watching. There's some matchmaking no, going on. She's no. not. He showed yeah. us a picture. He's like, look how hot my mom is. <laughs> no, it was so hot. It was from 1989. Oh, no, <laughs> Jesus Christ. No. He's like, wait, you want you want some pictures with her in a bikini? I was like, dude, calm down. All right, moving on. Uh, I'm trying. I'm gonna write. Right. Are yeah, you keeping track of how many uh, I read? You already know that from the other side, it just looks like there are three words written. Oh, uh, it's it's our it's our font. No, he's not. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it just looks like you're making this up. No, it's uh, on six right now. I own over ten thousand Pokemon cards. No. Too many. Yeah. I want to see how many lies I've told. <laughs> one more. I need one more. Okay. <laughs> this one's probably. Oh, I inadvertently appeared in a porn movie. I feel like all of them are true. You want to look at them? You can, you know, you can, you can, hey, look, you look the font. But I can run, if you need questions, if you want to. Did you actually like write true and false on this? Bill, collaborate with me. Young producer Bill, collaborate with me on this. Mainly he did most of it. Okay. Oh, that, that's, that's good. You trying to, he's, he's trying to, I'm not like too bad on it. You can help him as well. Yeah, you can help him. Bill is the only one who can help This is a very Which, are there any ones that you guys can automatically? Okay. Rule out or any ones that you can automatically say is definitely true. This is like the weirdest health class test I've ever <laughs> taken. Uh, just true. And, um, I say like three are true and three are false. No, you have to say no. two that are true. Okay. This is the new game is seeing how quick JR can figure out the rules of the game. Uh, that you have web feet. That's true or false? That's true. Okay, that's one. I have web feet and. and your mom, Slovakia. What you told my mom for? I'm just kidding. Uh, you are incorrect. Incorrect. My mom was from Slovakia. But I do not have web feet. I have beautiful well, looking feet. Well, that's just disappointing. Yeah. The other, the other Show true. Show your feet. The other, Show your feet. Show your feet. Show your feet. Show your feet. That's my only fan slash. So I'm just kidding. Uh, <laughs> I did inadvert inadvertently appear in a porn. I'm just kidding. My other truth was uh, I did pick it at a, a used car dealership. So yeah. you pick it like you protested yeah. a used car. Yeah, I got my money back. Like, I knew that was true. So wait, you? Yeah, I just thought what a random. So wait, wait, you went outside a used car dealership, 
car dealership with like a picket sign. Yeah. It was like, give me my. And there was a guy down the street had, who gave me ID. He even picketed. He picked no matter what, no matter anything. <laughs> well, he's like, no, you can go right there where there's the fire hydrant, like right on their property because that's public property. And here's a big sign. And I had, I said, I said, uh, honk, like Jacob's twin sells lemons. I tried to make lemon rhyme, very Kanye-esque. You know, you take two words that don't really rhyme. And, anyways, you don't win. What was your problem? We'll save this for next episode. Uh, All right. Wait, were you like homeless for like five years or something? Like, why would who does why would I do that? Yeah. Because I don't like getting screwed. Let that be known as a warning. Okay. <laughs> you guys are gonna get off the couch if you be so kind and, and move mm -hmm. the table because Helen Yay! is about to perform. Okay, I'm gonna have that. What if someone else came out? But that's very. Cool. <laughs> I uh, hello. Oh. I'm Helen. I just, I just became uh, an American citizen. Thank you. Woo! I'm originally from Belfast in Northern Ireland. I moved to the CS when I was wee, got made fun of for my accent, <laughs> and learned to speak like this. Hey, bullying works. Okay, don't do it. It is effective. I, uh, <laughs> I will say, I thought, I was like, if you don't know about, do you guys know about Northern Ireland? Yeah. Okay, you don't. That's okay. Normally, when you tell Americans you're from Northern Ireland, they just think you're weirdly specific. They're like, cool, I'm from Western Pennsylvania. <laughs> it's, like, it's a whole thing, though. Catholics, Protestants, my dad's Catholic, my mom's Protestant. They weren't supposed to get married in Ireland in the 70s. <laughs> Why did I bring that up when I came out? <laughs> uh, remember how no one wanted you to marry a prod? Okay. Um, that's like, when we first got to America, I thought I was like a cool double agent because I would practice my American accent for hours at home, just practice it. And then I'd go into school like, hey, y'all. <laughs> Let's go to Walmart. Okay. Uh, just classic American phrases. And then I go home like, Jesus, Mario, Joseph, Mom, I've got to go back to Walmart. Uh, she was like, stop inviting people. What are you doing? Um, like I did. I thought I was a cool double agent. Like, I was a star of my own alias type show. Like, I was Jennifer Garner. Okay. You wish, Helen. I also thought I was bilingual uh, when we first got here because there are like seven words that are different between Irish English and American English. So we go out to a restaurant and I'd be like, don't worry, Pam, I'll translate for you. <laughs> I'll just, you tell me, I'll tell the waitress. <laughs> and then I'd turn to the waitress like, actually, my father would like the fish and fries. <laughs> <laughs> okay, thank you. <laughs> Woo! I am Helen Kelly. Just so you know, Jennifer Gardner cannot hold a candle to you. <laughs> All right, we're ready for our next game, which is a favorite of people. That for the years, they've been loving this game, and we've been having it is... Yes, that 80s song! Woo! All right. All right. All right. Yeah, you, we're going to need you to keep the score here, Alex. All right, um, I'm going to play a song. You either need to say the artist, you need to say it out loud, okay? okay? Immediately, the artist of the song, the first thing you get right, you get two points. But let's say you say that the, the let's say it was beat it, and you say beat it, you get two points, but then if someone else says Michael Jackson, they get one point. After after point in time, I'm going to stop the song so it doesn't go on forever and also I don't get in trouble. Alright? No. Total points you can Everyone play. understand that? You just, you, and you can say as many guesses as you want. Because trust me, Bill was in the first episode and he would say TLC Waterfalls and then every other TLC song and <laughs> Bill Scrubs. Right, this was January, so 80 songs, JR, so <laughs> Okay. You can call your mom during the episode. <laughs> Good luck. Put okay. her on speaker. Uh, party all the time, Eddie Murphy, Rick James, producer. <laughs> <laughs> literally one second. That was amazing. That was amazing. That was fun. I mean, and the credit's given. Yeah. It's yeah. 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 a fun thing for yeah. people at home, as, as me not saying the prize ahead of time. You're going to be winning this lamp. What? Oh, wait. What are these? But wait. Not only that, oh. it comes with a bulb. Hey. Oh, yes. Thank you. Thank you so much. It is, it is the white lamp. So. Thank you. Thank you. He ain't even won it yet. Oh, I didn't want it. He's one round. I thought I won it. Damn, I got it. He's got six white Alex, hold on. He's, he's really he's getting a little trigger happy with his lamp. Hold Keep up. It I got to cover this because it shows the song. Oh, yeah, yeah. Good points. All right, oh, yeah. next song. Here. Incredible vision on the couch. That was hot. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Trust me, we've had. We had. Yeah, great vision. It's all right. All right, next song. I ruined it with my phone. Is anyone wearing contacts? Alright, that's not 
real song. I just like the Succession oh. theme song. So yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, wait, wait, wait. That's Succession. I know. Yeah. HBO Max. Take care. And for love's sake, uh, there's a Peaches and Herb. Um, yeah, Peaches and Herb, they're black. Uh, Peaches and Herb. You say, you say the name of the song is No, that's the group. Black? No, that's the group. It's Peaches and Herb. It's not Peaches and Herb. Or Peaches and Herb. It's not Peaches. No, that is Peaches and Herb. Herb and Peaches. Solid as a rock. Correct. Right. Solid is good enough. Who, anyone knows the name of the artist? Or the name of the artist? Oh. Not peaches and herbs. Uh, it's, uh, it's peaches and herbs. I'll show you after when it's not peaches and herbs. Okay, it's a black dude with a mustache. You are correct. It's a mustache. Black dude. What? Literally what? everybody in the East yeah, had a mustache. Trust me. He's black. He's got a big caterpillar mustache. I, I, can't, it's, I can't show you. It's actually Oh, yes. That's uh, right. That's right. right. All right. Simpson. So that's right. One, two points. Two points. Two points. Right. So what's the school right now? Uh... Keith with five. Uh, right. This is where you guys say can we play some white music in this thing? Like what you guys? Hey, Eddie Taylor Swift on this thing? That's uh, for the sound guy. Yeah. 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 Uh, Eighty-nine. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. The is that when they are born? I have a tiger. Oh, I didn't see it. Dolly Parton. This is I have a tiger. Two points. Damn. You know the artist? Okay, okay. It's a white dude Dolly with Parton? long hair. Come out, Dolly Parton. <laughs> You really think Dolly Parton? I thought it was kind of like, you know, I thought it was like, thinking, 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 oh. thinking, 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 Oh, oh yeah. damn, that's right. That's you are good. Right. I think because you're really good with the charades. I literally missed it. When they were saying, what are you doing? Comedy, just to watch Survivor. Yeah. No, wow. you got okay. high. Yeah. yeah. Jacob was like, <laughs> what are you doing? Sick. You weren't sick. You were high. No, that those three months, yeah. Yes. Yeah. That, that, that was high as fuck. <laughs> Like he just got high months. every Wednesday for like three months. Ah, just missed every open mic. Just to watch because, Survivor. Just to watch Survivor. It was, it was great. But Did you like, listen to Eye of the Tiger while you watched it? No, but I do play a lot of guitar. Huh. Alright, here we go. You got There is an 80s group called Arrested Development, though. That would mm -hmm. be crazy. Oh, oh yeah! yeah. Oh, David Bowie of West Ham. Whoa! Yeah. Can we talk about the fact the first time that Eddie Murphy did a song that was like a hit song? That's kind of hilarious. Yes. Yeah, Can we talk Eddie about Murphy? how many yeah. other people who worked on that song will be? <laughs> 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 He's like, bring my, produce my. Uh, this yeah. is the sound engineer. Like, yes. Yeah. Rick James no. is good. Yeah, no, we're, they recorded it in Buffalo during a blizzard. Oh, you played Eddie Murphy and like Rick James also. Jesse 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 oh, but um. Yeah. 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 Rick Springfield. We're very Rick, we're very yeah, kind with the things that are close. So three points for Helen. So what is we got We're into the last one. What's the score? Alex, right? Alex, get yourself on the film for the people, man. Especially all right, if you get your high all the time. What's the score going into the final round? Alrighty, the score. I think duck down. I don't think they can see Yeah. The score. JR with five, Whoa. Wafik with five, Helen with three. Oh, Helen can't can make the, the comeback. This is this is maybe the most exciting Get the 80 song we've ever had. They're so good at this. I know. It's so hard. Shit, it was on Transformers. This is a fucking yeah. pop. I just bought a group, and it's by, it's by Asia. <laughs> no, no, no. Oh, man, Every song was, uh, 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 eventually we'll say the name of the song. So is, it Eddie, Eddie. is it Eddie Money? No, 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 no. It's white dudes that sound black. They can sing. It's not all of us. That was last week. Oh, oh, what's his name? He was in a group first. Phil Collins. Yes. Phil Collins. Yes. Yes. yes, Phil Collins. And the name of the song is? Oh man, oh snap, what is this? It's, it's... Easy Lock Market! <laughs> yes! 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 Yes!
day, I would be, I would be, I would win something all my life. I've had things taken away from me. Uh, it was sixth grade Chandra Hammonds. He cut in front of me in the, um, in the, in the, in the cafeteria at Geeter Elementary School. Um, it was his eighth grade. I asked Kimberly Jones if she wanted to go out. She said, uh, who are you? <laughs> oh, man. So to come here during Black History Month and to finally win this, this white lamp. <laughs> oh, my God. Thank you. Oh. Come to Kente. We made it. Whoa. Take that, Kimberly Jones. Oh, good job. Thanks. Coming to the stage. There's the young kid, the one who lights up your world, the one who has a cat, our, our man, your man, everyone's man, J.R. Kusher! It's amazing. It's really... Yeah, Kusher. Really... What was the emphasis on that? It's just literally Crusher, but without the R. Yeah, sure. Yeah, you All right. Well... <laughs> yeah. Well, it is February, so, you know, we're feet. Like, doing this makes up for slavery, right? It's like, it's not like, that's like the whole thing, right? Yeah, probably, yeah. yeah it kind of does. I think it kind of, like, the 400 years of the generational, like, stuff that, you know, I guess happened since... It just washes away. It just washes away. It doesn't. It doesn't. Like, uh, like white people just do this for like the first like three days, and we all forgot about. It. But you know, we do this. Yeah. Yeah. Can I say the N word now? No. I'm not. I'm not. No. Sasha said this is PG thirteen, so I'm not swearing. But you know. I can say the N word, right? No, no. Yep. I can't. Yeah. Oh, wow. See what I, what? Okay, I'm saving that for later. Here. I'll get to <laughs> no, I'm saving that for later. I'm saving that. Southeast Raleigh tonight. <laughs> oh, at the fucking at the fucking church's chicken. The yeah. That's right. Right in front. Say it. I know. To be honestly, I'm probably gonna have this like with an argument with my mom. This is like the emotions that's gonna come out. But you know, it's good to know. <laughs> it's good to know I can say. Oh, uh, fuck. We just, this is. That's it? <laughs> is that two minutes? Or yeah, you one, like more two one more joke. One more joke. Yeah. One more joke. Why? Why? <laughs> <laughs> Where you you don't want to go over a hundred, okay? Okay. So and the, the 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 list of the points are, and I was gonna write them down, but you know, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. You guys remember? Hundred's closest one. So wait, hundred. Well, he just threw it was a hundred. That was actually pretty impressive. That was really good. So How one is, is the first. Uh, Ten is in the front. Then 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. We'll oh, tell you. Gets higher. Yeah. Okay. And you're going to have two shots for each guest because it's the first time doing it. But if you get it in, you can't then take another one. For example, if you threw this one and you got... You know what they're, You know what the people are asking me for me to do an example one? Should I do it? If the people are asking. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. How many points would that be? 90. 90, yeah. Okay. So then I'd be like, no, I'm not going next because 90 is a good score. You know, I'm not going to bust yeah. over 100. So it's just one and done. So you no. can try to get you that 10. You can throw a second one if you want. You could try to get that 10. And I think you should. Yeah, why not? Right. Alright, I'm gonna look for the rest of the. These, I went first on the last. These, these look like ping pong balls. Not. But they're not. They're staircase showdown balls. Noted. And you're right. I did this yeah. first, so I'm gonna not. Fair enough, right. yeah. You wanna go first? I'll go first, man. I'll take them. Alright, right. here we go. That's legal. Lady. That's the best guess. Okay. As long right. as he's on the staircase. Love it. That's smart. Oh! oh so you can redo that one. Okay, I'll redo Oh, it. you get a redo. Yeah, you get one redo for it. Oh, nice. I love this game. But I will do one for So. Oh! So that is, let's let us let's let everyone know, because the people at the home might not be as smart as us. That is how many points? 40. 40, good job, 40. So, now is the question. Do you want to go, you trying to get closer to 100, with the potential you might bust? 
But they add up, right? <coughs> yes. Yes, they add okay. up. But if they add, if he gets a seventy, for example, that's then. Which one is seventy? So you want to go here. This is sixty. So you want to go here and down. So we can't. So we can't hit. I really want to go right here. Closest to seventy. Yeah. Okay. 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 Ok
We find out right now how exciting. You gotta open it. Look, is there a hundred dollar bill in there? Well, that was already. This is going to be. Is there a hundred dollar bill in there? Oh, it's not bad. What did I? What did I tell you? The truck that we just won. Yeah, that which means that there you didn't win. You guys uh, the, the, the correct answer was. Oh wait, I, only I got to choose. Was like, no. That's my fault for not enough. The correct one was in number seven. I was gonna oh, say seven. Yeah, who guesses one and one to ten? That's like yes. never. No one. Well, this is like. Um, I thought we all agreed. Right. That was right. the game. Can I see that for a quick second? Because. No, we didn't want to see the hundred dollars one. It is time for. Not yet, but it's coming. It's the Dodgers. Closing theme. Thank you for joining us on this wonderful ride and adventure of the comedy game show. And now I'm going to mess up everyone's names again. Helen Wildey. J.R. Crusher. Crusher. It's like Crusher without the R. Yeah. And... Yeah. Yeah. Say, I want to hear how you say it. Say it. <laughs> <laughs> J.R. Kush. I mean, Rafiq Sarik. See that? They, that's the first thing they do when we come to this country. They take away our music. Music applauder. <laughs>